And the number one best glider with special effects and contrails is... Yo, what is going on guys? DJ Skills 88 here. Welcome back to a brand new video. I haven't said that in a long time and I'm really sorry about that. It's just for two weeks I wasn't really motivated to make videos. All this stuff wasn't really working out. My mic broke, that's why I have this one. But also I went on a trip to Canada which is really awesome and I really enjoyed that. But now I am back. I want to make a video a week. That's kind of like my goal for the school year I guess and so yeah since my last video absolutely banged it did super super well it got 11 likes and like 7 dislikes but I don't really care it got so many views and so many comments I want to thank you guys so so much for that and one guy actually commented to make this video which is a top 10 best gliders with special effects and like contrails and just really fancy gliders and so I thought that's a really awesome idea how about I just make that video and here we are today and so yeah let's get started so coming in at number 10, we have Cloud Strike. Now Cloud Strike is one of the first animated gliders in the game. It came out in January 2012 when I first started playing Fortnite. It is an epic rarity. The animated effect is pretty simple, but it's still pretty cool. The animated lightning looks really dope and clean. The color scheme is really good too. I talked about this one in my last video, so I won't say much. Now go check it out. <laughs> Alright, so coming in at number 9 is a pretty new one, it's called the Libre. It came out last month, and is a rare glider. The opening effect is really cool, you guys can kind of, kind of see it. The feathers kind of explode on the glider, and I don't really know how to explain it, but it just looks really cool. The wings are really colorful and appealing to me, and the Libre is just a dope glider. I would have put the feathered flyer in this spot, but I think that's kind of cliche. I feel like a lot of people would put that on their list, and so I thought I chose one that's kind of like different, but still kind of the same, it has the same wings effect and all that all right so coming along with number eight we have conquest now conquest is part of the season five battle pass and along with the comment that i mentioned earlier in this video this glider was an inspiration for me to do this list i thought the water effects and the paddles were really really awesome and then it's really detailed and the whole thing is really creative i really like how like you know how season five is about vikings and all that i think the conquest is a great glider and actually it's only it's like one of the only ones i have on that's on this list that I have because like, it's in the battle pass. It's like tier 39 or 40. It's pretty early on, so you don't really need to do a lot of hustling or grinding. It's pretty easy to get if you guys have the battle pass. So yeah, I would recommend grinding all the way up to level 39 to get it. It's pretty good. And so yeah, let's go on to number 7, and that is the Deep Space Lander. I chose this over the Orbital Shuttle, which is kind of like a similar one to it, only because I like the color of the glow on the Deep Space Lander a little bit better. That's it. They're kind of much the same thing. It's just the designs and shapes are a bit different, but I really do like this glider. The glow on it is really cool, and the thrusters look really nice, and it's just a really fun glider. I really like how the glider looks. I like the glow. I like the colors on it. I think it's really cool. All right, let's go on to number six, and that is the Cyclone. This is a very like, interesting glider. It is a motorbike glider, and it's pretty dope. The wheels look really awesome, and the thrusters, when they're powered, look great. There isn't a lot to say on it. I just really like the colors and just like all of it the wheels it's really interesting it's a really unique glider i don't think i never thought they would make a glider like it but here we are all right so coming in at number five is a very very special one and that is laser chomp a lot of my friends really love this skin glider or skin whatever a lot of people really really love the skin glider i don't know <laughs> This is the second legendary glider ever, so it has to be ranked pretty high. But even if it wasn't legendary, I would still really rank it high. It's still a really awesome glider. The shark, it's just a shark with a laser beam pointer, whatever. It just looks absolutely amazing. It is so, so creative. There isn't really much to say about it, because it's just like, it's kind of obvious why it's cool. It's a shark with a laser on its forehead. It just looks absolutely amazing. I didn't, it really wasn't like expected for me. I didn't think, oh yeah, Epic would definitely put this in the game. But it's just really crazy and insane, and I thought it's really awesome. I thought it deserved the number 5 spot on this list. Coming in at number 4 is my personal, one of my favorite gliders ever created. I don't even care if it has special effects on it or not. I don't care if all the other gliders have special effects on it. This is one of my personal favorite gliders. This is so crazy, and that is the Flying Saucer. I absolutely love this glider. There's just so much detail on it, and it goes really, really well with the Beef Boss skin. That skin is an amazing skin as well. I might talk about it in a further video, but just let me comment down below if you guys want to see a video about like top 10 best new skins or something. I don't know. 
But yeah, I love how the thrusters are ketchup and mustard. I think that's really creative. I just like how they're kind of blobs coming out of the ketchup and mustard. It looks really funny. And the whole thing is made of kitchen stuff. Like the salt and pepper shakers and the spatulas are there. And the wings are food trays. It is so amazing. I just love it. It's so colorful. And it's such a goof. And it's so creative. But it's just really awesome. I, I don't know why I love the skin so much i don't think a lot of people like it as much as i do but i just think it's so goofy and just creative and fun it's just like it's not like as serious as like i don't know i guess like people games like PUBG would make their gliders all like serious and tough you know trying to make it look all like edgy and stuff but fortnite just take, doesn't take itself that seriously it just makes really awesome fun gliders that's why i love fortnite so much all the fun and cool skins are just amazing it's easily one of the best gliders in the game right now, and I don't, I, it's just, I just love it so much, it's just insane. Alright, so coming in at number 3 is a glider that I didn't even know was in the game, I thought it was like a, one of those leaked gliders that are fake, but it's the Visseroy Mark 1, I, I guess that's how you say it, and it is a freaking car, man, like I didn't even know that was in the game, I just, I looked it up like just now, and it's in the game, I'm like, what? I didn't even know that was a thing. But yeah, it is a car glider. It isn't the flashiest glider. It isn't like the coolest, but I think it is really cool. It reminds me of one of those cars from the movie Cars, and I think that's why I like it so much. It was first seen on July 2nd, and it was epic. Like I said, I did not know this was a thing. It was a huge surprise to me. And I do actually like this, the thrusters that came out of like the back of the thruster pipe thing. I don't really know much about cars <laughs> but i think it looks pretty cool like i said it isn't like the flashiest it isn't like i don't know like the flying saucer where it's all creative but it is a car and i do like how epic is trying stuff out i'm not sure a lot of people bought it though but i don't really know why i think it's pretty cool i would have bought it but i think it's really unique and creative i don't think a lot of people would actually have like a glider as a car it's pretty insane and i really like this glider so coming in at number two, number two and number one are kind of interchangeable. I like them pretty much the same, but I had to like, you know, rank it, and so here we are. Okay, so coming in at number two, we have the Forerunner. It has an extremely cool orange lighting effect that I love. I think it looks amazing. I don't know why, I just really love like lightning, orange lightning. I think it looks amazing. And this glider, it's just or it's orange and it has an orange lightning effect. It is so crazy. When you first launch it, when you first hit deploy, it has a really dope lightning ball and kind of like an orange power. I don't really know how to explain it, like an orange dust cloud thing. I don't really know how to explain it, but that's just how I would explain it. It really looks fantastic. I really love this glider. Epic really went all out. And like I said, I couldn't really decide between this and number one. I think it's just one of the craziest gliders in the game. I would definitely buy it if I had like more V-Bucks. I think I would definitely buy the skin when it comes back into the shop. I'm not sure if it actually will come back to the shop because it's like really cool. And I think Epic will want to have it more rare. But I think it's just an insane glider. It looks amazing and I really love it. So coming in at our last spot, number one, we have Terminus. Now, it's like a much cooler version of Interped and Wings of Valor. I think this is like the king of like those kind of gliders, those kind of like glider effects. And it looks so freaking sick. The colors are amazing and the trail is just so dope. The glider looks, really looks like Epic spent a lot of time on it. Their glider design team is just amazing. I really, their gliders are really awesome. And this glider is like probably the best glider I've ever seen. It just looks so amazing. The, the, the vibrant colors and great effects make this one of the best gliders, if not the best in the game. The colors, the effects, just all of it makes it an overall amazing glider. This and the Forerunner are probably my favorite gliders in the game. That's why I have it as number two and number one. They're just so insane, and I really like how Epic is making these really amazing gliders. I know a lot, of, not a lot of people buy actually buy gliders because you don't really use them that much but with the new storing 50s mode i think it's still out by the time i'm recording this then you're gonna have to use it a lot and i think that these gliders are amazing i would definitely recommend these gliders for you guys to go get and yeah that's pretty much it for today's video thank you guys so so much for watching i know i made like two other videos i deleted them because i don't know i've made a lot of fake promises and i know this video is late but i had a lot of stuff not working i tried to make a whole other video and it didn't that that, that didn't work out i had to do re do, I don't know, it was a mess. But now I have this video, and I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Make sure to you leave a like and subscribe. Share it with your friends if you guys like it. I kind of want to branch out and not do top 10, like, cosmetic items, because that's kind of what the Smith Plays does, and I don't want to copy him. And so I'm thinking about doing more, like, strategic stuff, 
talking about guns and strategies. I'll still be doing Fortnite because that's what gets me a lot of support and that's what I really enjoy doing. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you guys for all the support on my last video. I'm trying to get this video to get to 10 minutes. And I'll see you guys next time. Tears Close 88 out.